about, I think, 2004, 2005, I, I, I was a very, very different person. Uh, I, I had issues, man. I, I had, I had issues, big issues. I, well, for one, I, I couldn't stand the look of myself in the mirror. It's, uh, I had, I had really bad self-esteem. I, you know, I would look in the mirror and go, ooh, you know, who's that? You know? And uh, I, would, I would consistently be worried about what people thought of me, about what I did, you know, how I would look in public. So, so I had all these challenges. And I, I got pretty fed up. I got pretty fed up. And, and, and uh, along the way, around 2004, 2005, I realized that, you know, that, that was no way to actually live. Uh, and I wanted confidence, I wanted self-confidence, and I wanted it badly. And so, what happened was, I, I read this book um, that said, you know, use physical conditioning to change the way we think. And I thought I'd give it a try, and, and what this book said, I, no, don't ask me what book it is, I really don't remember all, after all these years. And what this book said was, you know, when you think of something negative, every time you think of something negative, what you need to do is you need to you know, wear a rubber band, keep a rubber band on your wrist, and what you need to do is to, can you see this? I think you can, it's a rubber band. Stretch it out really far, and then you let go. And it hurts, okay, it hurts. And, and what happens is, that here's the theory, that when every time you think of something negative, uh, you give yourself a little bit of physical discomfort. And what happens is, very soon, the brain associates thinking negative thoughts as being painful. So it stops. I mean, none of us would continually do painful things to ourselves. So, and soon enough, I, so I tried this. It, it, uh, the book told me to do it for 30 days, and I tried it. So I wore this. Day one, right, I counted. I had to snap this rubber band 30 times, 30 times. So throughout the day, I was thinking, oh, this guy's an idiot. Oh, oh uh, so no, I don't think I can do that. Oh, this driver, you know what that? So any negative thought that crosses my mind, I will have to snap the rubber band. So I did. First day, 30 times. Second day, 30 times. And geez, by this time, my wrist was getting ugly, okay? It's, it, it didn't look, look very good. It didn't feel very good. By the end of the week, uh, from 30, it went down to about 25. <sighs> by the end of the second week, it went down to 20. By the end of the third week, it went down to 10. And here's the interesting thing. And these are negative thoughts, by the way. These are negative thoughts that, that is automatic to me, that has been with me throughout my entire life. Okay? And, and here's the interesting thing. By the end of 30 days, so, first week itself, okay, first day, 30. By the end of the first week, it was 25. By the end of the second week, it was 20. By the end of the third week, it was 10. And by the end of the month, by the end of 30 days, zero. I, I, unbelievable. I stopped snapping my, my rubber band on my wrist because I actually stopped thinking negative thoughts. And, you know, sure, I mean, that's the occasional one or two. We're all human. I mean, we look, we do need certain negative thoughts, okay? But the disempowering thoughts were oddly gone. It just poof, thin air. And by the end of the 30 days, I could take this off. Um, uh, two years later, a year later, I, I, I left my engineering job, which I didn't love. Uh, I could do that because I, I had this new self, uh, renewed confidence about myself. Uh, uh, three years later, I started my own uh, business, which is Education Republic. And wow, guys, so really, if you want something life-changing, and if you want a trick, a simple little thing to achieve it, wear a rubber band. Okay, take a rubber band, find one from your kitchen, just, just get one, okay? Put it on your wrist for 30 days, and every time when you think a negative thought, you snap it. It changed my life, guys. And I think it might change yours. Have fun.